my code to get $25 off your first purchase. Yeah. Welcome to my channel. I'm Natasha Charmaine and if you are new here be sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the like button if you enjoy this video and to everyone else welcome back. On this channel we do beauty, we do lifestyle, we do travel and we do fashion where we believe it's not what you wear but how you wear it. So in today's video we are doing another Stitch Fix. I absolutely love Stitch Fix. I've been with Stitch Fix now for almost, I want to say two years. Um, I have my card here and they say that this is stitch number 21. That's a lot of fixes y'all. Um, and I have gotten some stuff from them, from the stitches that I've received because my stylist does a pretty good job at selecting and curating uh, outfits and items that I like based off of my profile and um, I've pretty much kept the same stylist because you have the option to choose a different one if you feel that the one that you currently have isn't doing the job for you. So yeah, if you're here for all of those Stitch Fix pieces, let's get into this video. All right, you guys. So my stylist sent me basically pieces that can transition from the spring to the summer, which I'm really excited for because this spring has been a little, little crazy. Um, it's cold some days. It's a little warm. It's a teaser. But then here in New York, it gets cold again. And I'm kind of over it. I'm just ready for like a steady warm vibe like I'm just so over the spring and spring is actually my favorite season but um this time I think I'm kind of over it but um it rained like really badly the other day we're in May mind you it's supposed to rain in April and have like April showers and then May flowers I believe that's how the saying goes but it's raining a lot in May and um I'm not liking it but I digress uh <laughs> so let's get into the first item so the first item that my stylist sent me was Button Up Crop Top by Vera Moda. Um, this button up top, let's, 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 let, let's take a look at it. Um, it's a cotton top. It's white with black polka dots. It's got the elastic at the top of the shoulders, which means that you have the ability to wear it off your shoulders. And it actually looks pretty nice off the shoulders as opposed to on the shoulders. Um, in the cutaway, you'll see I styled it with a pair of jeans and a pair of um, heeled sandals, which looks really good for the style that it is. But um, I don't think that there's too much that you can do with this top. And for that reason, it's not really a favorite of mine. Um, it's got like a little flutter sleeve and it buttons down in the front. And that's pretty much all that I can say for this top. <laughs> but um, I mean, it's cute if you like that kind of thing. And it's definitely great for the summer. It's lightweight, it's white, and it's playful because of its green polka dots. And you can pretty much wear this with denim jeans, denim skirt would be really cute with a pair of uh, platform sandals or a pair of wedges. I mean, you can really do something with it if you try. But it's not my favorite and for that reason I think I'm not going to keep this one but um still cute nonetheless let's get into the next item all right so the next item that they sent me oh I just remembered there was another item that they sent me I didn't actually try it on but I do have a picture of myself in it because mind you I've already worn it to work but I'll come back and I'll get back to that one so let's skip this and let's get into the sleeveless black back cutout cropped jumpsuit from Market and Spruce. Market and Spruce 
um, usually has really great items. I found that a lot of the stuff that I bought from Stitch Fix turned out to be items from Market and Spruce. So let me just show you this jumpsuit that they sent me. It's an all black jumpsuit. And um, I like this, the, the, the straps. They're not spaghetti straps. I don't always like a spaghetti strap. Uh, but this for your big boob girls, <laughs> um, a thicker strap is really good. I'm not saying I have big boobs. I'm just saying that for a big boob girl. I'm telling you that I like these type of straps as opposed to a uh, single strap, like, you know, the really skinny straps. But this jumpsuit is pretty cute. You'll see in the cutaway that I styled it with an oversized belt, which gives like this boho vibe and um, these like um, pewter, almost like a pewter colored earrings. And I wanted to give it that boho vibe and I just took a blazer and I styled it over my shoulders in like this mustard seed color, which I thought was really nice. And then of course I would, I paired it with a pair of sandals again that I did get from Stitch Fix. But um, one thing about this jumpsuit is that it's got that cutaway in the back, that cutout that I like. And um, of course, if you're wearing a blazer, you wouldn't be able to see it. But nonetheless, I like this jumper. The legs are, I want to say a straight leg. And um, it's straight throughout. So you've got a lot of room in the legs and everything. This is a really cute jumper for the summer. I like this one and I'm going to consider keeping this one. I think I could do a lot with this and even coming towards like the fall. I'm already thinking about fall, y'all. I could style this maybe with a mesh top underneath or um, even like a lace top in black like this under it with a pair of boots and a jacket or a sweater. I think that I could get a lot of wear out of this and um, for that reason I might just keep it. It's pretty stretchy and um, I believe it could be made out of cotton of some sorts so it'd be breathable and uh, keep you cool in the summer. So that's it for the sleeveless back cutout cropped jumpsuit. Let's get into the next item. Now I like these. I like these a lot. These are a pair of jeans. They're ultra high rise cropped Joe jean and they are by Seven for All Mankind. I remember when I bought my first sevens, I went to Nordstrom and I bought them and they were $150. And at that time I was like in my twenties and paying $150 for me was unheard of. But these jeans fit so precise and so good. The stretch in them alone, it made my butt look like a pumpkin. And I love the way they fit. I still have those jeans to this day. And what I ended up doing is I had to get them hems because they were a little long, but they were the most perfect fit jeans that I ever had. And I wore the hell out of those jeans. I wore them so much that they started fraying on the inside of the thighs. And I sent them over to this company called Denim Therapy. I don't even know if they're still around. But Denim Therapy did their magic and they made those jeans look like brand new. And I still have those jeans in my closet. The only downside is that I outgrew them. I can't fit them anymore, uh, which is why I'm on my fitness journey. <laughs> I gotta lose this weight, y'all. Anyways. <laughs> so here are the sevens. They're in this light wash that I absolutely love. Um, and they are a wide leg, which I find to be really, really cute because I don't own, well, actually I do own wide leg jeans. I just haven't worn them yet because my weight is up. We gotta do something about this, y'all. I can't be big like this. Having a baby is not easy. And it's been three years, okay? Just so you know. But again, I digress. <laughs> but anyway, these jeans are super cute. You'll see how I styled them in the cutaway. And um, unfortunately, they're a little snug for me. They sent me a size 29, which is my size. Um, and the stretch is really good. It helps. It, it fits all of my curves perfectly. But again, these are a little snug and um, I'd be very uncomfortable wearing these on the street because I can't breathe. <laughs> I might need to do that if I'm going to go somewhere, right? I might need to breathe. So um, I'll see if I can get them in a 30, but I really do like these. These fit the bill for sure. And they're perfect for summer because of the light color. And um, I'm not mad. I recommend these 10 out of 10. Highly recommend. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so good. I like these. They're so good. 
All right, my camera is about to die. So I'm going to change the battery and come right back to you with the, I think it's the second to last item. So let's do this. Um, all right, so the next item is the Ramona Pleated Blouse uh, by Monday Fun. Now, normally I wouldn't go for a blouse like this because it's so frou-frou to me. And by frou-frou, I mean, I'm not really into stuff that has like a bunch of flowers and, you know, kind of country or not that there's anything wrong with that, but I'm just not into that. But I saw this blouse and the first thing that came to mind was I could wear this to work. And right now, you guys, I am so into red. I don't know what it is ever since the holidays. I think I mentioned this in like every single video that I do, but I can get so much wear out of this because I am so loving the red. Um, unfortunately, I've worn this blouse to work already because I saw immediately how I could incorporate it into my work wardrobe and I've worn it with my navy blue um, trouser pants that I got from Stitch Fix. <laughs> and I love this. I absolutely love this. I wore it already. So, you know, keeping it 100. Yay. Love this blouse. Yeah. So anyway, this is the Monday Fun by Monday Fun Ramona pleated blouse. Um, it does pleat down in the front. It has, uh, what is it? Oh, it buttons all the way down. You know what? I didn't even realize that it buttoned all the way down because I threw this bad boy over my head. Um, they sent me a medium and it fit really good. The only thing I am going to dispute is the fact that the tag that says Monday Fun in the back of the neck scratched me all day when I wore it. And it was uncomfortable and I had to turn it in or turn it out while I was sitting in my office so no one could see, but it scratched my neck all day. So basically what I'm gonna do is take the tag out. <laughs> but I love this top enough that, um, of course I'm keeping it because I've already worn it. Um, it's got these really cool cap sleeves that I enjoy and this is gonna be great for the summer because um, when I go outside, I could always take my blazer off and be cool, easy breezy. I can probably even wear this after work to an event with a skirt or something of the sort. But um, I love this top. Don't know why maybe it's the red it's definitely the red <laughs> and um i'd say 10 out of 10 highly recommend so and of course you can dress this up with a pair of denim uh on the weekends um throw on a pair of sandals with it i think it'd be really cute cute it might even look really good with the sevens uh wide leg and a pair of sandals so speaking of sandals let's get into the next item which is the last item that they sent. All right, so the last item that they sent me are the Charlotte Leather Wedge Sandals by Mia, M-I-A, and um, Chunky Sandals. Super cute. I think I like these. I don't own anything like this right now. I think I remember when I was in maybe high school, I had a pair of sandals that were like this. In the front um, but they weren't chunky that's for sure and uh, they're still keeping with the chunk style uh, that's pretty much trending like with the boots from the fall and the winter of last year um, I actually really like these though they are sending these to me for let's take a look Mia Charlotte Wedge $69 Hmm. Not too bad, but keep in mind, if you use my code, you'll get 25 off of your first stitch fix. And um, also they charge you $20 every month and that $20 goes towards your purchase. So if I bought these, I've already got the $20 that was deducted from my account and that $20 will deduct from the 69 and these would be $59. So of course, whatever I get, you know, I get that $20 towards whatever I purchase, how many items I purchase. And I also get a discount, which is really good because if you buy all of the items, you get a discount off of everything, including that $20. Yeah. Yeah. So we're going to think about this and uh, 
decide on what it is we want to get but i do like these and i've already worn this and i like the jeans i'd have to send them back and get the 30 but all in all it was a good fix my stylist did a good job she did she did a good job <laughs> All right, you guys. So if you enjoyed that video and you found that the items that my stylist uh, sent to me were good, let me know below which were your favorite pieces. Um, also, let me know if you would wear this because I'm on the fence about it. I do like it. I'm just not sure if I would actually wear it because sometimes things don't always translate to what you may have in your closet just because you see it and you like it. And you may not get enough wear out of it. So that's one of these. That's what this item is for me. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you back in my next one. Bye guys.